and I'm so happy that you can retire and I can't wait until we can play together and I'm so glad that you took the college job under my subtle prodding. The kids are pretty happy too. I remember them being very happy because they were really getting sick of sloppy joes. So I just want to tell you so much. I love you and you're going to have a fun, fun time. Hey Pop. I uh, just wanted to wish you congratulations on retiring, and now uh, you can have tons of free time to do all that stuff you've always wanted to do, like build that shed, or make that fire pit, or actually clean the garage. Um, but I just wanted to say I was proud of you uh, for taking the risk, with a little help from mom, obviously, um, and we were kind of glad too, because uh, you're definitely better at carpentry than cooking. Um, but I just want to tell you I'm proud of you and now you have tons of free time and uh, congrats again and I love you and miss you a ton and can't wait to see you guys. Love you. Hey daddy, it's Petey. I just want to tell you happy retirement and I'm so proud of you and I love you so much. Um, I want to thank you for all the sacrifices you've made over the years for me and for our family. Um, waking up at 4 a.m. to go to Moorhead and driving, you know, three hours total a day, working over the weekends, working late at night. Just want to let you know that I really appreciate everything you've done um, to get me to where I am today. Uh, now you can be the ultimate king of ding and just play whenever you want. And uh, now you can start focusing on you and taking care of yourself and your health. But I just wanted to let you know how much I love you. I wish I could be celebrating with you. But in a few short weeks, we'll see each other and we'll celebrate then. I love you so much. Hi, it's Molly. I just wanted to say happy retirement and I can't wait to celebrate with you in a few weeks. Bye. 
Congratulations, Uncle Gene. We're so proud of you that you finally got to retire, and this is what you get to do when you retire. Gino, come see me on the beach, buddy. I got a cold old mill waiting on you. Y'all have a great time. Bye -bye. We love you. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. Hey, Uncle Gene. I am not what one might call looking my very best, considering that um, while my children might think I'm retirement, I actually am not, and tomorrow we have our big move to Colorado. But I want you to know how much I love you and how excited and proud I am of you and how thrilled we are that you are finally going to get to be like Granddaddy. So like Granddaddy watches the beach, you're going to have to find something incredibly important um, by which to abide your time. I personally would like to recommend woods watching because I know that I would like to be there in the woods with you ASAP or sooner. Love you. Happy retirement. Bye. Hey, Uncle Gene. It's Chase. And Tom. And we just want to say... Happy retirement. And we love you so much. Mwah. Hey, Uncle Gene. Thanks for teaching me everything I know about fishing, ice fishing, just generally being a cool person and being awesome. I love you so much, and I just want to tell you it's going to be a hell of a shot next year. You got lots of time in this retirement to figure it out. Get me ready for a good shot. A hell of a shot. I love you so much. Love your favorite niece. All right, hi guys. Hi. Hey, Mom. Hi. All right, so we're gonna make a video for Uncle Gene because Uncle Gene is retiring. <laughs> does anybody know what that means? Mm. Okay, what does that mean? Mm. Thorntons. Like it means like you're you're done with your work and you just get to play. Cool. That's actually very kind of true. Holden, do we know anybody else who's retired? Who? No. Mommy? <laughs> I'm not sure if Mommy's retired. Do we know anybody else? Okay. Thornton who? Granddaddy. Granddaddy. And Papa. And Papa. That's true. Okay. What do you think? If you were to be retired, Harrison, look at me, guys. If you were going to be retired, Harrison, what would you want to do? Um, I don't know. What would be What would be your favorite thing to do if you were retired? I would just keep keep doing it. I just keep doing it. Okay, what's your favorite thing to do with Uncle Gene? Um, go weasel trapping. Go weasel trapping? Do you think Uncle Gene could do some more weasel trapping while he's retired? Mm -hmm. Yes. A lot more. A lot more? And he could collect them. I wonder I wonder what he could He could collect is. them. And maybe get some earn some money collecting them? And then get a new job. Woohoo! Well, hey, can we all wish Uncle Gene a happy retirement? Happy retirement. I wish you, um, I hope you have a good, um, retirement. Mm -hmm. Okay, can we, we all, get a new job. can we all, can we all tell him we love him? I love you. Okay, Thornton, you first. We love you. Love you. Love you. We hope, I hope you, I hope we get to go weasel trapping with you again. <laughs> all right. Love you. Hi, buddy. Hey, Uncle Gene. Would you like to say anything to Uncle Gene? Uh, Uncle Gene, um, my favorite thing, um, is, um, when we do golf trapping and, and, um, when, uh, when the little things were I'm told. The gophers? Or no, the, um, weasels? They're told weasels. Okay. And those weasels, little trapper, trappers, and those and the meat and the and the weasels, um, but there was the meat and the traps. That's darn not good. Blueberries. Say hi, Uncle Gene. It's Westy. Now that you're retired, you can get me lots of blueberries. Yay! Yay. Say I love you. I love you. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.